Hey guys, welcome back to Film Title. Today we'll talk about my feet are killing me insane moments. Let's head into it. Sebastian's feet. A Pittsburgh man with a secretive condition, known as Epiderma dysplasia versiformis, is at last encountering alleviation in the wake of having the developments in his feet eliminated. Sebastian Quinn's, Sebastian Quinn's clinical exertion was shared on the new period of TLC's arrangement, My Feet Are Killing Me. The condition comes from an issue with Quinn's invulnerable reaction. He's one of only a handful few individuals on the planet to be influenced thusly. The condition frames enormous developments on his feet that are amazingly excruciating and keep on developing, said Orange County expert Dr. Ebony Vincent. Sebastian has a quality change. Thus, his resistant framework is sufficiently feeble to permit these developments to develop anywhere on his body. Vincent said in the arrangement, while the condition is uncommon, it has been noted before in the news. There's been an instance of this that was in the media. The man was known as the Tree Man of Indonesia. I've been looking into this case explicitly as far as how to approach treating Sebastian, Vincent said. The Tree Man kicked the bucket at age of 45 because of intricacies related with a debilitated safe framework. Quinn hasn't had the option to work since he was 17, which was the last time he could wear sneakers. He's not searching for work during the COVID-19 pandemic since he's so high danger. The Super Long Big Toe A lady with an inconceivably long toe left a specialist stunned. As he conceded, he's never seen a patient with this long toe. Anna Tantilio showed up on TLC's My Feet Are Killing Me, where she told foot and lower leg specialist Dr. Brad Schaefer it harms truly downright awful that she felt he was her last choice to figure everything out. Dr. Schaefer clarified that her extra long digit is probably going to cause a wide range of issues later down the line. He said, when you have a foot where your toe is, similar to twofold the size that's sticking in a shoe, each progression you take, that will cause joint pain, that will make sticking of the joints, and it will cause torment each progression. After investigating Anna's toe, Dr. Schaefer says, that is certainly something. Her toe sort of pops directly out at you. I've actually never seen a patient that has this long of a major toe. It's incredibly uncommon. A class from the show, which circulated recently, as of late, re-emerged on TikTok, where clients were in dismay at Anna's gigantic metatarsal. Be that as it may, Anna isn't the only one to have an extra long extremity. A month ago, a youngster circulated around the web on TikTok after she flaunted her gigantic center finger. Olivia Murcia, 16 from Arizona, chosen to possess the way that she has a more drawn-out center finger, importing her silly video to the subtitle, so are you needed to see it. In the video, she can be seen grinning, with the content, me pondering the time my 5-inch finger circulated around the web. In the end, she makes a gesture of blowing a kiss. As the video says, my toes are more regrettable. Addressing Lad Bible, Olivia, a yearning model said, I would say I understood it was longer than several years prior. From the outset, it was a weakness. However, then I understood it was in reality beautiful interesting, and something that would continually bring out chuckles. Her super long finger has now been seen on a great many occasions, with Olivia stunned by how much consideration it's gotten. The response to my TikTok has been crazy, she said. I never imagined that it would arrive at the level that it has. The poor Miss and Cheese Feet. My feet are killing me. My feet are killing me, Dr. Brad Schaefer. It's resolved to help Nate, a patient whose plantar keratosis makes them shave down developments with box cutters and a cheddar grater. Regardless of whether the two can't meet face to face for now, requesting that Nate hold up his feet for the camera, Schaefer gets a close glance at the hard developments developing everywhere on the underside of the feet, which Nate taps with his clenched hand to show exactly how hard like a stone the calluses are. So when you crush them and stuff, what is the consistency of that? Schaefer asks. To which Nate reacts, so the underlying layer is extremely unpleasant and hard. Under that, it's somewhat more sodden, somewhat more delicate. I would say, as gross as this sounds, it has the consistency of like parmesan cheddar. That layer of the develop will in general snare dampness in it, which Nate says has caused the greatest issue for him by and by. The unpleasant part about that, it will leave a smell in the shoes that will not disappear, he clarifies, incurring as Schaefer accepts there is a genuine funk going on from his point of view. Attempting to keep under control these developments, which additionally tormented his dad and grandpa, Nate has gone to some beautiful drastic actions, getting some uncomprising, getting some uncomprising gear to treat his feet. For it's are these box cutters that you can simply purchase at the store. They're truly valuable for getting enormous, as large lump, as large lumps off. He clarifies of this foot normal, at that point pulling out a grater from his bureau. This resembles a cheddar grater, sort of. It resembles more like the last little details, like in grinding it down genuine grate. What's more, you just, you know, rub it on your foot and plates fall off. What do you think about these moments? Let us know in the comment section. This brings us to the end of our video. I hope you enjoyed it, hit like if you did, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any of our videos in the future. Also, watch the two videos that are on your screen because I'm sure you'll love them. With that, I'll see you in the next video.